We're here in our Burlingame facility uh, building our second generation prototype that builds off the learnings last summer 2024. I'm Willie Mendelson. Uh, I lead the technical programs team here at Peak. Just now done welding uh, our first sub-modules uh, that'll eventually go into a full unit that'll ship out this summer um, for deployment in our first uh, real-world pilot program. I'm Adriana Rappin. I'm the process engineer here at Peak. This is the first step of our flow. What happens here is we decant um, all of our cells from their box. Um, they come in from incoming inspection. We place them in the cell test drawer. And then once the battery comes out, we do um, our foam placement here. And the foam placement essentially sets the battery up for the next step of the process, um, which is our stack process. At which point, we're able to band them so that they can be self-sustaining. And then we laser weld and interconnect their terminals so that we can build the brick voltage uh, throughout the sub-module. I'm Sean Hughes. I'm a lead manufacturing engineer here at Peak. We do a lot of quality tests to ensure that we are passing all of our certifications and then move on to ensuring that the sub-module is safe and well-packaged be placed into its future product, the module. Once the module gets loaded into the unit, um, there's more interconnections there. My name is Diana Sachs. Uh, I am the technical project manager for the ESS manufacturing and cell manufacturing team here. Um, a lot of the electronics starts to happen at the module and the unit level. We use a crane to load it onto a truck, and then that truck takes it to our deployment site. 